Parents, if you have teenagers at home, listen to this. Studies show Memorial Day marks the start of the most dangerous 100 days for young drivers. NCDOT says over 1.2 million North Carolinians will be on the roads this weekend, many of those teenagers. Not on your side, Abigail Velas joins us in the studio now. So, Abigail, what are experts saying about these new drivers? Well, Ken, they're saying there's a number of reasons why teens are more susceptible to accidents on the road, but one is clear. They're just not experienced behind the wheel. Here's why the next 100 days are dangerous and what we can do to help. We call it the 100 deadliest days of travel uh, for young teen drivers because that's when the number of crash fatalities involving teenage drivers rises. Jamie Kritzer with NCDOT says there's only so much the state can do to ensure teen drivers have at least some experience before handing them a license. If you combine things like inexperience with somebody that's trying to text, it's a really bad combination. To get a license to drive in the state of North Carolina, teen drivers have to have at least 60 hours of supervised driving. Tony Moore is the owner of the North Carolina Driving School headquartered in Winterville. Unfortunately, though, he tells me he is all too familiar with the dangers of being on the road. My mother had an accident when I was 16 years old. And for the next, she was conscious three months. For the next 43 years, she was a challenge. And then I had a son die this past July at age of 45 in a car accident, only doing 35 miles an hour. When his airbags come out there loud, and they can be very um, abrasive, mm -hmm. but they do save lives. They just shouldn't save the life of my son. Moore says these tragedies in his life have made him an advocate for safe driving. He says it's important to talk to loved ones, especially teens, about dangers on the road. Tiffany Wright with AAA agrees. And teens, you know, they, they're, they're, they're very connected to their phones. They drive distracted, unfortunately. So there's a lot of contributing factors. Speed is one of them. A lot of times they can be a little bit more uh, overzealous and reckless behind the wheel. And AAA of the Carolinas encourage finding this contract on their website. It's an agreement between parents and their teen drivers to promise that they will be responsible on the road. They say something like this could definitely help start that uncomfortable but necessary conversation. In studio, Abigail Velez, 9 on your side. Abigail, thank you.